There's life after Barry Bonds in the ballpark by the bay. The Giants are entering unfamiliar territory, opening 2008 without number 25 in left field for the first time in 15 seasons. But a bevy of young talent has San Francisco excited about the organization's future. It's a different uh, culture in this clubhouse. Uh, we're trying to get younger, more athletic, and and uh, these young guys are, are, go are going to get a good chance this year. But now it's a new time for us. It's, uh, it's uh, a time where you know our young guys are going to get an opportunity to play, show our energy, show everything that you know people doubt our, our farm system and, and everything that we've done. And, uh, it's an opportunity for all of us to uh, come up here and uh, enjoy ourselves and, and show what we really have. Just the youth of this team, I think it just gives us a little more energy. I mean, we got a little fire under our, uh, under our butts right now. I mean, just kind of with the way things went last year, a lot of expectations, at least from our, ourselves, you know, to do well this year. You know, we, we can't just keep, you know, rolling out these 20 game under 500 seasons. After enduring a season in which they rank near the bottom of the National League in multiple offensive categories, the Giants are hoping to utilize their small ball approach with their new look lineup. A big part of that will be center fielder Aaron Rowan, the Giants' biggest offseason splash. Obviously, we don't have Barry Bonds any longer, so you know we're going to have to play a different style of ball. We're going to have to be able to bottom line execute. We have to play and hit like professional hitters. Um, we're, we'll hit some home runs. I think we'll hit more than most people think. And I think we're going to score more runs than most people think. People are always, you know, they're going to downplay our offense and. Uh, say because we don't have any power bats. I, I didn't know power bats won you games. You know, I, it maybe you know one or you know maybe five games a year they might you know with a home run at the end. But I didn't know doubles didn't score you runs either. If everything goes right for them, I think they can finish as high as maybe third. But uh, that would mean a lot of uh, a lot of things would have to go right. Obviously, the pitching would have to meet its expectations. The starting pitching that everybody uh, touts so highly. The bullpen will have to come through as it didn't do last year, and the small ball offensive attack will have to actually uh, generate some production. What will it take for the Giants to become players in the NL West this year? Chemistry figures to be a vital component for a young team trying to establish their identity. We're excited. We have a, a new atmosphere in the clubhouse, you know, something that we have to get used to, obviously. You know, we don't have a huge superstar there. Uh, to kind of uh, you know guide us everywhere we go now, so uh, we're starting to learn you know who the leaders are and those things. This year it finally feels fun when you come out in this atmosphere and you know uh, you're working, you know, and it's not even work. It's just that this has been real exciting, real fun for us, and it's a different attitude. The Giants clubhouse should be able to shed the spotlight that follow Bonds every movement in recent years. The relaxed atmosphere is a change that many within the organization believe will help them compete in 2008. From Giants Camp in Scottsdale, Arizona, I'm Brian McRae, MOB.com.